Our associates were interested in all things green and were concerned about the environment. Montgomery County has a very highly educated group of consumers and they expect the people they do business with to be conscious of the environment. We have a process and our management system earned certification from ISO. So we're a 14,000 company for our environmental management system. The ISO 14001 environmental management system is an international system of standards where we write down what our processes are. It spells out exactly you know, what we need to do and it measures what we do and we are audited by an outside agency. A lot of people know what that means and our customers think that's important. For a combination of my associates and my customers, I was dragged kicking and screaming into uh, environmental conscious, I'm green. We were the first green energy partner of the EPA. We do the right thing. Well, as Mr. Fitzgerald has always told us, it's the right thing to do for our children, for our associates, and for the community around us. Working for a business that has a sustainability mission is wonderful because it shows they have concern about the health and welfare of the employees and the community around us. We have electric car chargers. We recycle 83 percent of our solid waste stream. We're converting dealerships to LED lighting. 100 percent of the electrical power that all of the Fitzgerald Auto Malls use are wind power and renewable energy credits. We just started investing in speed doors that use less energy and will close six times faster than a regular garage door. In 2015, Fitzgerald Automall recycled over 2,600 tons of recycled material. The company does provide training for recycling. Uh, there is a video that we the employees get to watch to explain all the items we recycle, how to recycle it, where it goes. We have a traveling team that goes to each store uh, made up of our green team members and we talk about uh, primarily recycling. Someone brings their car to a dealership to have their oil changed. We recycle the waste oil, we recycle the oil filter, we recycle the box the oil filter came in. We're always looking for additional things we can recycle in trying to reach zero waste. We recycle our scrap tires, our scrap metal, batteries, bumper covers, fluorescent bulbs, used coolant, antifreeze. Plastic bags, wood pallets that parts are delivered on, lithium batteries that come in the remote control for your car keys. Those are things that we don't want to end up in the landfill. We don't consider our environmental efforts to be just a one-time event. It's an ongoing process. And in order for that to happen, it starts at the top. We need support from upper management to be enthusiastic and support this activity. If my people want to do something, that's what we do. They pushed me gently in that direction, so one thing leads to another, and we worked at it. I think we had a lot of loyal people before we started being green, but if you want to keep them, you know, that's what you do.